to be in the kitchen. Anyway, I went to the shop and I bought a nice, a lovely snapper fish. You know what I mean? I do a foil fish. One of our fans requested it, and I definitely made it. Thank you so much for tuning to the show. We got a lot more recipe, a lot more ideas, and a lot more things coming out for you guys. It's coming up to Easter, and remember, we got Easter bun coming out. We got a lot little bits and pieces, fried fish. You know, I mean, you can do your Easter fried fish and decorate it and make it look really nice. So, guys, enjoy the whole fire wrap fish, guys. It's just amazing. So, thank you so much for tuning and subscribe is very important. Leave your comments below and also likes and also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, Google Plus Chef Ricardo. One more time, stay tuned, don't go anywhere. This is our Chef Ricardo and the team, and thank you so much for watching the show. And lovely guys so basically I'm gonna show you how you can do a fire fish I'll put it in your oven all right so first thing you can either use parakeet fish snapper fish for the fire fish this nice lovely fish look at this one yeah this is a snapper and honestly really nice all right so first thing I'm gonna put it right here because I want you guys to see, I got then after I put it right there, let's you know what happened. I'm gonna be naming up my ingredients for the fans. Eh? So basically, fish is inside of this container right here. And I need you guys to see exactly what's going on inside of the bowl. Alright. So first thing what we're going to do is do this kind of way. Yeah. We're going to season up the fish and hopefully it will come out the way we want if it come out. No hopefully it's gonna come out the way we want to come out. Alright. Alright. So basically prepper. Alright. On the other side. In the inside. As I can see, put some prep up on the outside and the inside. Pinch of salt. Nice one. All right. So, um, this is some fish season which I'm going to be using. All right, a little bit of fish season. Um, I wanna say, honestly guys, the fish season is really, really nice. And you know what I mean? I encourage anyone to do, use the fish season. Well, we got a few pimenta seed. We're gonna put some pimenta seed in it. Remember, I was I did a video on my YouTube channel talking about how pimenta seed is good for losing weight and all these things. All right, so we already done that. We have the salt, the pimenta seed. What we're going to do next is cut up some thyme. We got some fresh thyme. We're gonna put some fresh thyme on it. We got some yellow pepper. Also, some spring onion. Some spring onion. You have to take care of it good on the right and proper way. Um, red pepper is a must. We got some red. Yellow pepper, green pepper, all kind of pepper.
this is some white onion one thing we got a medium sized carrot which will I'm just gonna simple remove the skin from the carrot yeah man I'm gonna show you how you can make yourself a file fish and wrap it up in some file and cook it up at home honestly you're gonna love this recipe guys it's a new recipe new ideas and we have to share it with the fans them. Because my fans them I said Chef Ricardo a long time you know you're not fishing up. But me know, but me know it's not never done before the time. So basically I'm just cutting up some carrot. That's the carrot. Yeah man. And um, I got some okra. Okra, nice, huh? A lot of people doesn't like okra, but a lot of people doesn't know that. I'm using four, five okra. Uh, okra is good for you. Cut up some pepper. This is some scotch body pepper. Just don't want to cut it on the board. All right, let's put a three piece in it. Wash out the knife because scotch body pepper is really hot, you know, guys. Be careful here. Don't bother for yourself. Guys, really, really hot. Scotch body pepper. All right, then we got some. Garlic. I'll put some more garlic in it. I'm gonna use three cup of garlic. All right, this three cup of garlic. So I did one already. A simple. Cut it up like this. Not gonna take too long to cook. Yeah, so basically we're gonna put a little bit of herbs on it. We got some oregano herb. That herb is good. A lot of people don't like cook with herbs and everything, but honestly, if we did use most of those things, we'd have much better off with our life. So mix herb. Um it saved me have anything else can I put on it. We're gonna put a little bit of all purpose season. Put some fish season on there already. Let's put a little bit of all purpose season. Put a little bit of olive oil or vegetable oil on it. Just to just free it up, you know what I mean? So basically that's it so far. We're gonna put some butter. Let's get the butter. Nice one. So I just put two nice lovely thick pieces of a butter. So what we're going to do now is get some foil. A lovely portion of foil. I'm gonna give a fans them some secret. Now enough of a fans them doesn't know that you have, you have to very be careful when you're using foil on your food. Alright? Uh, foil is not too good too much with your system and the food and all these things. So basically rub up the fish be careful with the bone and you don't want to you know what i mean cut yourself all right there's a big fish as i can see rub it up with some butter all right so this is inside of the fish so basically you need to put some of the butter on the fish all right some of the season Make sure you stuff him down right. Alright. 
Because a lot of season the pan, you know. That's the way we want it. Alright? So, what we're going to do next, I'm going to show you what we're going to do next before we do anything. So basically, what we're going to do now, as I said, get the foil to a nice, lovely piece of foil. Alright? Get a piece of paper like this one. Then get some of your veg, everything. All of your mix up veg, get a little bit like this. Then next thing, rest the fish on it like this. All right. Then place the rest of the veg. Yo, I would have checked your gun away. We have to look after ourselves and our body and all these things. Alright? So look at that. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Let's remove this now. The reason why I'm using the paper, yeah? The, 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 the paper is better for use with the foil. Because what happened? If anything should contaminate the foil and the fish of the foil, nothing will happen to you because it is in the paper. Then they use the foil and wrap your fish like this, like this, like this, and like this. All right. Then get a piece more foil just to make sure your fish really seal. And just wrap it like this. Some people wrap it on a different kind of way, but some people wrap it long way, all kind of way. But you know what I mean? You can do your own research on foil. Some foil doesn't good for your system and nowadays we don't know what kind of whatever mixed with the foil and you know what I mean that can lead to cancer can lead to so many different things with the foil so you have to be careful when you're using foil at home sometimes it all depends on the kind of meat where you're doing where you can just wrap a piece of foil over it but like the fish and all these things you know so they're gonna be covered with the foil you have to be careful so that's the reason why I wrap it in the paper first and then I wrap the file around it because nothing gonna do the paper the paper will be fine all right so let's know guys what we're gonna do we're gonna place this in the oven for roughly at least half an hour the least half an hour we're gonna place this in the fridge and then we will take it out after half an hour time all right so basically place it into a tray like this and bake it in the oven for half an hour nice recipe enjoy it subscribe and leave your comments below as i say can't go wrong if you did it this kind of way all right thank you so much guys all right so basically don't get scared everything is fine um just take the fridge the fish from the fridge from the oven so i bake it for 30 roughly about 40 minutes i have it inside of the oven for the reason why because i wrap a lot of file and the paper so you're gonna take a little time um if you're using electric oven gas mark electric oven i'm using 180 gas mark six or seven is good let's remove the file to see if i can see any good news all right yeah so this is exactly what i was talking about because a lot of people doesn't know that the foil doesn't good for your body all right so that's why i use the paper instead of the foil because sometimes you go to some fish shop you know, doesn't know because a lot of people doesn't take time to do research to see what foil good for or what if you go on google and type in if foil good for your body yes or no 
Google will tell you. Alright? So guys, don't feel any way because you see me wrapping with paper. I know that in Jamaica they use file, but when you do research and you recognize you don't want to tell your fans them to use file. File doesn't good for you when you're covering food and gonna cook it like this. It can give you cancer, it can give you all sorts of stuff. It can give you. It doesn't good for you and it was big on the news a couple months ago. So check it out. Alright? So guys, anyway, I'm here same way and what we're going to do now is simple. Get a fork and let's, let's take a good look at the fish, alright? So let's take a good look at the fish now. So if we remove all of these little bits off one side, fish very soft and nice. Alright? Yeah, nice one. So that's exactly what we're looking for. What we need to do now is to take the fish and put it on a plate and decorate it, alright? Very easy recipe guys and you know what I mean Chef Ricardo is in the kitchen, don't feel any way we will really give you a recipe what the fans them need to get So basically, take the fish and we're gonna put it on a plate Alright, you might just say one to the veg and thing Just give us a second that's the fish. Look at that. Is that beautiful and nice? Really nice. Look at the steam coming out of the fish. And the fish very soft. Alright, so let's put this one side on the fish. One side and one side. Alright. Don't stress it too much. Get some of the summer salad. And put it one side. This is some summer salad that I make earlier. Honestly, really nice. Then what you can do is get some of your, your seam veg and decorate a fish. All right. Really nice, guys. And honestly, I know you guys will love this one. Don't feel any way. If you got lemon, and all these things don't no shy, you can decorate a fish yeah, I hit that too you see that? look at that beautiful and nice yeah so basically it's just something to show the fans and what you can do at home. You know what I mean? Certain little things that you can do at home. So just enjoy the recipe, subscribe and leave your comments below. We've got a lot more recipe and a lot more ideas like this coming out of your way. Five fish from Chef Ricardo, the Jamaican way. Enjoy the recipe, subscribe and give me a like. See you next time. Bye bye.